What's up guys, Barry Gaming here, back with some more Idol Heroes, and today we're going to be going over something that might just help you guys in the Void campaign. Now, it's a very specific situation with specific number of Transcendence Heroes that this is really going to help boost your power up, uh, but even if you have less than, you know, like five Transcendence Heroes, this can still help maybe a little bit just to soak up some damage, so if you guys are wondering what we're talking about, let's jump right into it. <laughs> So a lot of people out there, probably a lot, a lot of people out there have probably around three to four Transcendence Heroes at this point. No, unless you're spending money, you probably don't have enough of a team to really push and have like a solid Transcendence Hero lineup. But there are a couple weird things you can do, and this is mainly for people who have like five Transcendence Heroes. This trick is going to help you guys a lot. If you have less, it's still going to be kind of good because... What we're going to show you is going to be something that helps absorb maybe some damage. But what you guys are going to need to do is regress <laughs> the imprints on one of your Transcendence Heroes. So just for example, you guys know when you regress these right here, of course I can't do it right now. Each one of these nodes is going to give you a puppet. But what it's going to do is is going to give you a 10 star Transcendence puppet, which counts as part of the Transcendence faction. Uh, you don't want to level them up. You don't want to do anything like that. I mean, you could throw like a golden crown on them or something if you have something crazy like that. And then, of course, you're going to need to take other 10 stars and put them back into your hero. Uh, now, you guys might be thinking, well, Barry, if I just have like, you know, one Transcendence Hero, can't I just keep doing this? Like, regress them and build a bunch of 10 stars and then have five of these puppets? Well... You know, the rule of one still applies, guys. If you don't know what I'm talking about, the rule of one is, yes, this is the same exact hero as this, and you can't have two of the same hero in your lineup. However, if you're coming in here and you're like, Barry, I, I, only, have, I only have five Transcendence Heroes. Well, guess what? Now what this is going to give you, this is going to give you your aura, whereas previously, if you don't have six heroes in your lineup, you're not going to get the deploy six heroes to activate the aura, which could be significant. Now, are you going to be able to push far doing this? No, but you might be able to push a little bit further than kind of where you guys were stuck. So, uh, puppets kind of matter, and they can help you out, especially if you're in that weird special middle ground scenario where you just need one more Transcendence Hero to fill the lineup to get that nice bonus buff. Uh, I feel like I'm never going to pass 175, just to let you guys know. I don't think I'm ever getting to stage two, <laughs> but uh, you never know. But that's a little trick you guys can use. Again, the way to get them, there's two ways. Regressing a Transcendence Hero or regressing the imprints. The imprints, of course, is the much easier way because you don't have to worry about rerolling stones, all that fun stuff. And remember, you can only use one of these puppets. Hopefully this helps you guys out. Let me know what you guys think. I'll see you guys next time.